Hey everyone, this is Bremster coming to you with the next problem in my Sudoku problem series. This is a killer problem sent in by Missing Deck, which is full deck and missing a few cards. Um, and this one I really like the look of. So the goal, of course, is to place all of the digits in cells marked with an X. Um, you might be able to do this one in your head. I found this one, um, I couldn't. I needed a grid for this one. There's a link to the grid below. Um, killer cages, of course. You, um, The digits that are placed within the cage must sum to the number in the top left corner of the cage. Um, that's the rules we've got for this one. So um, feel free to give it a try. Um, pause the video and I'll come back in a few seconds and explain how this one works. Okay, so... This one, um, the, the start of this one, I found I had to use what is generally called the secret. So what that means is um, if we look at an entire box of a Sudoku, then it must contain all of the digits from one to nine. If you add those together, you get 45. So um, we know that the sum of all of these digits is 45. However, we've got an 11 cage and an 11 cage, which is 22. Add a 13 cage, that is... 35, add a 5 cage, that's 40. So we know that these cells sum to 40. So this has to make up the difference. So this is a 5. Now, once this is a 5, um, we've got a couple of things that we can think about here, and I'm trying to remember how to do it. Um, so the question basically now is, where can 6 go in this box? Because if a 6 goes in an 11 cage, it has to go with a 5. So you can never put a 6 in an 11 cage, and a 6 in a 5 cage would have to go with a minus 1. So the 6 has to go in the 13 cage, and it will go with a 7. Um, so then what we've got left is, um, actually that's a damn fine question, isn't it? This is going to be one, two, three, or four. I actually haven't solved this one in a while. Um, there's going to be one, two, three, or four. The 11 cages, we have to put a nine in one of them. Um, and we have to put an eight in the other. So these are actually going to be two, nine and three, eight. So we can't put two or three in here because we can't put one in an 11 cage. So that's right. We can't put one in an 11 cage. So this is one, four. Now we actually need to use the secret again, because what we have is if we look at column um, five, this is 15 and this is 15, which sums to 30. So we know that these need to sum to 15, but we've already got five. So these need to sum to 10 in order for the column to work. We don't need to worry about what the, what is in the cages. We just know that those two cells need to sum to 10. If that was a four, that would have to be a six. That doesn't work. So this is a one. This is a nine. This becomes a four. The nine makes this a two. So there is no two nine in here. And now we have to, in order to figure out this, have to do the same trick again. 21 and nine is 30. This is 35. These have to sum to 10. Six would have to go with four. So this has to be seven. This has to be three to make the 10 work. That makes this six, makes this eight. And that is the solution to the problem. Having to use the secret three times to get the digits, I thought, beautiful little problem. I hope you were able to figure this one out. Um, I think this is possible. This is one of my favorites that I've seen so far. I really liked this one. Um, I hope you're enjoying the series. I hope you re enjoyed this one as much as I did. Um, yeah, thank you everyone for watching. And as always, good luck with your solving.